Yeah, I have to use Toxic Protect Stalling. It takes like six turns, I think. Seven turns? I don't know. I think it's six turns. I think Manchow should destroy Armard Omar ah, Armaldo. Armaldo. Maybe. What does it have? It doesn't hit that hard no matter what it uses, I think. I could be wrong though, because I am three levels under. We'll see though. Let's hope this doesn't miss. And I'm dead. Rip. Ah, that's a fun one. That's fun. 90% chance miss. Gotta love Pokemon sometimes. Crush Claw, X Scissor, Rock Blast, Stone Edge. Something like that. Oh, hold on a second. There's a lot of Pokemon that are sturdy as rock types. It's kind of annoying. I don't think I can tank this. Not without- oh my god, yeah, I- I don't think I can- I don't think I can use Flygon! I really want to, but I don't think I can. Too underleveled. I wish I could. It would make this run a lot easier. I mean, a lot more fun, too. Because I love using Flygon. Fun Pokemon. Oh, right. You can Rock Blast. <laughs> wow, this team... Uh, on paper, I thought this team would do decently well. I guess I'm just gonna have to cheese it still, because the levels are a bit off still. Holy crap. Didn't think I'd be having so much trouble. I'm trying not to use Skarmory. I think this was another one where uh, Hippodon carried. Man Shell with Revive is fine, because it has Regenerator. But I think I have like three more revives. Two after I revive Gyarados. Damn it, why couldn't you miss Gyarados? There's a chance that was a mistake. Because Toxic might bring it down to danger levels, and then... Oh, never mind, it's fine. And then Full Restore, but I think it's fine now. Gigalith. Ooh. Oh, 
Yeah, I just gotta cheese everything. Don't crit me. Ooh, that was a good one. I think I can KO now. Poison Tick plus Iron Head should be KO. Without her using full restore, I mean. Oh, come on, really? Ah, uh, maybe that was the that was right at the threshold, the full restore. Oh, I can't wait until post game where uh, I can change my hair and stuff. That'd be really cool. That's the last Stone Edge, I think. Iron Head Poison Tick should be KO here, and it's probably not going to use Stone Edge anymore. Hopefully, it doesn't explode on me. Not that it really matters. I don't deal that much damage. Gigalith's move pool is really questionable against Skarmory. Doesn't really have any options. It's got what? Earthquake? Iron Head? Does it have Gyro Ball? I can't remember. Obviously Stone Edge. Rock moves. Stealth Rocks is probably the only way it can actually do damage. Rock Pokemon are not going to use rock attacks on fighting Pokemon. So it's going to go for... What is it going to do? Hmm. I think I outspeed this. I could be wrong, but I think I outspeed this. So it's not going to use a rock attack, it's going to use something else that's good against fighting, but I'm pretty sure Skarmory can resist everything. If it's like Earthquake or something. I'm not even sure if it learns Earthquake. Counter. Oh! Okay. I almost killed Skarmory using Min Chao. That's funny. That is... That's lame, actually. Oh, crap! That's probably going to kill me. Protect is what? Half damage? Against Z-moves? This is a stab Z-move against high defense though, so let's see if it does... Oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Skarmory OP. Trying to damage Skarmory? That's funny. With a physical move, I mean. Oh. Ouch, that's actually really painful. Hmm. This one's gonna be rough, I think. Stone Edge is kinda rough. If it crits, I might die. What is it, like 30-40 damage? Okay, good thing it only has 80 accuracy. Stupid move. Good thing he doesn't have no guard. Nothing has no guard on hidden abilities. What? I outspeed it? 
Oh, I am a couple levels higher, I guess. It doesn't matter. So protect, heal, iron head, kill, heal, and that should be it. Actually, this thing is decently tanky. There's a chance that Iron Head doesn't kill. Hmm. So if, if the Poison Tick doesn't kill, then he gets full restored. And that's gonna be problematic. Never mind. Got it. Probo Pass is a quad weakness to fighting, so unless I miss this, it should be fine. I hate you so much. What the hell? Why does it always miss? I swear, it can't be 90%. It has to be a lie. 90 accuracy, yeah, okay. If this misses, I actually do die. I don't know if I can kill. Can I? Okay, I can. 130 stab is a bit too strong, especially quad damage. Good thing I hit it before with fake out, so sturdy didn't do anything. Cradilly. Cradilly, Cradilly, Cradilly. How do I deal with Cradilly? Grass? I could use Skarmory, I guess, again. Cradilly can't do anything against Skarmory. Except, like, ingrain or something. I can't remember if it uses Leech Seed, though. That could be annoying. Rock Tomb. Oh, come on, don't do that. Yeah, Skarmory is over leveled, everyone else is under leveled. She's not overleveled by that much, though. It's like a safe amount of overlevels for a Nuzlocke run, anyway. But for a casual run, it's pretty overleveled, I guess. Ghost Pokemon. This is where I wiped last time in the not so Nuzlocke. Let's get some revenge then. The scariest Pokemon is Mimikyu. And probably Miss Magius as well, but I think Gyarados kills them all. What is her lead anyway? Does she lead with Miss Magius? Or is it Bayonet? Or is it Drif Drifloon? 
Triflim. Spooky Face? I forgot what her lead was. It's Bayonet, okay. Bayonet should not be a problem, unless he uses Will-O-Wisp. Fake Out doesn't work, so let's just go straight into the U-turn. Wait, what? Bayonet outspeeds me? How is that possible? Isn't Bayonet like 70 speed or something? Does it have Prankster? I can't remember. I don't think it does. It has Infiltrator, doesn't it? Or, or does it? Huh. Interesting. Man Shadow's like 100 something speed. Base speed. That was a crit, wasn't it? Ow! Wait, Bayonet outspeeds Gyarados too. What's going on here? Well, Gyarados is somewhat slow, I guess, but ow. Let's do one more Dragon Dance for safety. But if he crits me again, I'm dead. I don't even know if that's safe. We'll see though. I'm pretty sure Crunch can one-shot everything except for Mimikyu. Ghosts, other than like two of them or three of them, are really, really squishy. Delmies. Hmm. This is a somewhat tanky one. But not, still not that tanky, it's like average defenses. Double Dragon Dance is too much for it though, I'm pretty sure. Single Dragon Dance though, might not have killed there. So I guess it was for safety. Is Palisand tanky? Or is it especially tanky? I can't remember. This is what I wiped on. This thing has Giga Drain and some of their ridiculous stuff. Iron Defense. I think that thing is a special tank, not a physical tank. Oh, did she just not have Mimikyu? I see. Don't kill me with Aftermath. It's like, what, 25% of my health? Yeah, okay, good. Yeah, that was a lot easier. Jeez. It's pretty bad with Nuzlocke rolls on. Also, Gyarados being like level 46, I think, or 48. Gyarados is 48 when I did it last. Mimikyu could have been a problem. There's a chance that I could have died to Mimikyu if she had it. That's one of the reasons why Disguise is so good. Disguise Toast. Does she lead with Talonflame? Talonflame, I think, outspeeds Manchow. Jeez, that Talonflame killed in killing Persian was really unfortunate. Oops.
If she leads with two cannon, I cannot speed that easily. If she leads with uh, Talon Flame, I can't outspeed that. If she leads with anything, uh, let's just find out. I think this battle shouldn't be that hard. Famous last words. Oh, it's Braviary. Ah, I cannot speed this. In before I can't. I'm pretty sure I can. There we go. Oh wait, no, that's fake out. No, I'm pretty sure I can. There's, there's gotta be. I have to be able to outspeed this. I lied. What the hell is this thing's speed? Is it like 100 or 105 or something? Hold on a second. I'm actually really curious. Am I wrong about that? Yeah, 125 attack with 105 speed. Braviary is like 125 attack with 80 speed. And it's only 3 levels higher, so it shouldn't gain that much speed. Unless this thing is minus speed, is it? I don't think it is. Wow, that's some crazy special attack. Well, that's really unfortunate. Really, really unfortunate. Because I don't think anyone can tank this thing except for Skarmory. Braviary is really powerful. Let's see what this thing is. 123 attack, 80 speed, and I got outsped. Its abilities are Keen Eye and Sheer Force. Not Gale Wings, obviously. I'm out of revives, huh? What about full revives? I have one full revive left. Jeez. <laughs> I may have to redo the Elite Four again, but this time I have money, I guess. I'm just not gonna res him. It's not worth it. Well, I think it is worth it, but... Nah... Damn it. Halucha. Halucha's a fighting, or a, yeah, fighting Pokemon. So theoretically, Zoe does well here. But let's bring in Grima. It might have a rock attack, though. A lot of fighting Pokemon have rock moves. This throat chop. Please don't poison me. Oh, 
Oh, this is a minus defense Gyarados. That's why it takes so much damage. Okay, what's the damage on this thing? This is 65 times 2, 130. This is 135. Uh, accuracy is 90 and 95. I think Ice Fang is technically more damage because of the accuracy. I mean, it doesn't really matter as long as it goes off. Although, Aqua Tail might push for lethal. I'm not sure though, but it is Double Dragon Dance. Never mind. Double Dragon Dance is always lethal. Mandibuzz. This pro this thing probably has that thing where it takes your statuses and turns them against you. So I need to one-shot this. Let's go with the accuracy play again. I think it's probably a one-shot no matter what. This thing is kind of tanky though. Oh, crap. Wait, what? This better not kill me. I don't think it can, yeah. That thing is really squishy. I mean, uh, really weak. Not squishy. It's not squishy at all. It's really tanky. Let's just full restore, because she's going to match my full restore. I'm not sure if Aqua Tail pushes for lethal. It might. Max damage Aqua Tail might be lethal in one shot. Uh, it's being annoying. Oh wait, no, it's not lethal because Brave Bird was the reason why it uh, dropped to low HP. Whoops. Is punishment the thing that turns your status is against you? Jeez, that's so painful. Uh, crunch is 40 damage. That bird looks so angry all the time. It's decently tanky too, but I think I can kill it. It's not Mandibuzz level tanky. Oriana? That's kind of brutal. All right, time for the champion. Dun dun dun. Where did Kukui go, I wonder? Okay. What else do I need to do? Oh, is there something that resurrects? One of the bitter items that resurrects? It's not energy root. It's there's another one I think that resurrects, but Laura's happiness. I don't have that at the moment, I guess. Huh, I guess I just can't lose any Pokemon then. Let's do it. Let's just res for the fake out plays. Fake out U turn generator plays. It's pretty worth. Actually, is it minus speed? I gotta figure this out. 
No, it's neutral. So why was it getting outsped by things that shouldn't outspeed it? Oh, right. I got a PP restore. Uh, let's use the berry. I think the berry is the cheap one. Four toxics, I think, is enough. Do I need anything here? No. What about you? Aquatails. Five Aquatails should be fine. Crunch is fine. Dragon Heads is fine. Four Fake Outs may not be fine. But we'll just go with this for now. I think it's okay. 